The blues is not notes. The blues is a social studies in survival. Where my father came from, Cleveland, Mississippi, and places of that nature, their whole situation was to get out. You were behind enemy lines. parents left the South like uh, the grace of wrath, having to wait on kind white people to buy gas for him because they wouldn't sell gas. There's such a rich history of black music in America, it's influenced the world and the blues is a big part of that. For Driving While Black, I wanted to get authentic music played by authentic artists. Joe Bonadio is a great session drummer and can hang with a click with great feel. Kevin Jenkins played with Shamika Copeland and Cindy Lauper. When I was young, I worked with Larry Coriel, a great jazz guitar player, and I got to know his son, Morali, who I taught a few lessons to, and I knew that Morali was very involved in the blues world. Brian King, I met when I was about 10 years old. This was in the mid-70s. Brian taught me my first songs. I ended up touring as, uh, as an opening act, supporting act for B.B. King. So I'm really grateful for my relationship with Joe Louis Walker. Some people get their dues paid for them. We had to pay our dues. Joe nailed the song on the first take. It was really, it was the real deal. There's nothing like live. Singing with the guitar, with everything going all at the same time. There's nothing like that kind of energy. That sounds like something from the past and from the future at the same time. That would be, I think, what was created for the film in this case. Speaking of driving while black, I mean, I've been on uh, on tours where guys come over and try to drive us off the road. Yeah, the police pull you over, pull a gun on you. It must be in America that all black people have a broken tail light. <laughs> You know what I mean? There's certain things that you, you know is coming. To me, that's the blues. You know, the blues are not notes. It's not gold records. It's the social studies and survival. And we survive. You can't play the hand you're not dealt. You gotta play the hand you dealt. Today, as we sit here in COVID, everybody's got the blues. But my wife put it best, she said, you know, if we can't roll in the same direction when we have a virus that's killed 200,000 people, then we are in a heck of trouble.